Hi guys, welcome to the kitchen here at Friendship Shaving and I have a razor that I'm very pleased to be able to show you. I've been after one of these for a very long time. You can see I've got it here, parts of it, and I am going to cheat a little bit because I have had it out of the box and I have cleaned the plastic and the razor already. So you'll be seeing it at its best. But this is an original Gillette Executive Adjustable Razor in its original box, which has seen better days. It comes in a plastic case and I've taken this bit out. You can see there it's a pattern on the front and the reason I've taken this bit out is because it's damaged here and uh, there's a little bit of plastic missing off there that just needs gluing back on. Of course that would sit on the case like that a little bit of flex there would open it and you take that off to get to the razor so that probably will never be strong enough to be used again but that's what the front top of the case will look like there is a slight scratch still on it at the top here somewhere but I'll work on that to get it as clean as I can Now, I already have, let me just show you the address there. Can you see the address there? Great West Road, Isleworth, Middlesex. So, this is a British model. It fits rather tightly in the box. The razor is American, I think they were shipped over and the British address is just on the box and on the paper instructions for the razor. I had this razor already, I had one as a gift from my good pal Sven, a replated version, but this came as all original. Really it was the box I was after because as you can see it displays beautifully. I'll just put this to one side like that. The razor lifts out there. Can you see that little lip there? It sits under the guard bar. How well designed is that? But this is the razor in original condition. There is a slight mark in one of the doors um, but it certainly with the light shining on it from up under the cabinet here uh, it, it's impossible to see that and there is a very little mark there that's been like scuffed or something or caught on a tap maybe but anyway that is that is the razor, all original, it all works very well. When I first took it out of the box, there was a razor blade in it, and those old razor blades are dated. And this one is F3, which is the third quarter of 1960. And I guess that was the last time it was used because on the blade dispenser there are also some razor blades in there and the blades in the dispenser are also F3, third quarter of 1960. I've got the original instructions and again it has that address on it
fantastic condition, fantastic to have the original instructions. I'm going to just leave those as they are guys. Very careful with these instructions. I don't want to crease them any more than necessary. So we'll put them in like that. All I've done with this guys is I put it in my um, ultrasonic cleaner just for 15 minutes and given it a buff. That's how it come up. Um, fantastic. Just fantastic. Everything works really well. The last quarter turn on the handle. The adjustment clicks as it should. Uh, I put a little drop of oil on the mechanism just to uh, lubricate it again after it had been sat in my ultrasonic cleaner. I have had a strange week this week guys. My mum has been in hospital and the reason I'm telling you that is because it relates to this razor. Um, so I was worried about mum. She's okay now. She's back home and she's okay. Um, but I wasn't sleeping uh, very well. So one night I couldn't get to sleep. I got up and made a cup of tea and I was just looking through eBay and this appeared for £200 or best offer and I put in a cheeky offer uh, of £150 and at some point I went to bed and uh, when I woke up the next morning I couldn't see it anywhere and I thought oh somebody's bought it you know by now then I went and had a cup of coffee and uh, I thought, hang on a minute. I went back on to eBay and I looked in the purchase history and my offer had been accepted. So I quickly paid and it was sent off. And here it is, guys, a Gillette Executive Adjustable Razor. Um, the case was just a bit dirty. That's all. It's just had a wash. And a clean with a nice soft cloth. Brilliant. So there we are. That is the latest piece in my collection. I'm chuffed to bits with it. I'll be out in the outhouse later gluing this back together. Um, and to be honest guys, it'll just sit behind my display like that. And it'll never be used properly on the top, but there we go, I've got the whole thing. So I hope you're having a lovely day, a good start to your weekend, and maybe you've enjoyed this video. And uh, I have certainly enjoyed making it. Thanks for joining me, guys. You take care now. Bye-bye.